Hi, my name is Judith van Herwaarden and I'm the Global Principal Customer Experience for Heidelberg Cement Group. Heidelberg Cement is a world leader in aggregate cement and ready mix concrete. In the last decades, operational excellence has been the main strategy. With cost leadership and continuous improvement, the key drivers of our performance, which we did well, it cemented our position as leaders in many markets. But times are changing and the world around us changes quicker than ever before. The traditional competitive advantages that we used to have are under pressure. The external world changed drastically with concerns around sustainability and increasing needs for digitization. Our customers are changing the way they design, they build and they run their construction sites. This means a risk for us, a risk of falling into a commodity trap where prices are our final battleground. But also we saw here an opportunity, an opportunity to create a new source of competitive advantages by offering unique solutions to our customers that could help them face the challenges ahead. To do this, we needed to understand our customers better than anyone else and design experiences that help them succeed in these new markets. So in 2014, we started with a pilot that put in place a customer experience management processes in one of our businesses. And this pilot was a success. CX works for a business like ours just as well as any other. What we learned, however, is if we want to scale this globally, we need a digital enabler to help us capture the feedback of customers, work through the analysis, visualize dashboards, and manage the actions that come as a result. So when we started rolling out globally, we started working together with Gemseek to build that customized platform and help us do that. Our business has a very complex organization and because we are active in 50 markets, the customer base is very fragmented as well. We needed to create a solution that sets a global framework but allows local businesses to use it suited for their strategy, their capability and their market circumstances. The platform that we build has done this. It is a global structure that's followed by all of our markets, but allows to put market specific and business specific context into the process, the surveys, the customers they upload. One major advantage we have from the CX platform is that it allows us to align our business and work cross-functionally. We have in the platform, not just our customer facing staff that obviously works through it with our customers, following up on feedback, taking some customer related actions, but we also have our operational departments active so they can see the performance of their part of the experience and the perception customers have on that and put actions in place to develop processes to improve that experience for customers. One of the targets we have implementing this CX program is the cultural transformation of our business from that operational focus to customer focus, externally looking uh, at opportunities. And that is only achieved through cross-functional alignment around a customer uh, need. The platform allows us to put all different functions, users in the platform that can look at customer feedback, act on that feedback, check how that impacts future performance to really work on customer changing needs in real time. Our partnership with Gemseek goes far beyond just using the CX platform. We've got a support function available to our global users to help them use the platform. Secondly, we are using a global network of agents that's managed by Gemseek to do phone surveying with those, for those customers in those markets where email is just not the right approach. Finally, we're using the analytics team a lot to give us greater insights into what priorities we have at a strategic level to start developing our business into. What is it that those customers need that we can use to differentiate ourselves in terms of the experience we provide them? In 2020, Gassam achieved a record sale of over 3 million tons compared to our plan of 2.8 million. 
This was a first in our 53 years in existence. And due to the feedback that we picked during our MPS process in 2019, we learned as first hand that our customers were losing out of sales due to the cheaper Chinese products in their various markets. Among the many actions that were conceived was the introduction of a fighter brand that we call Super Cool. This product was segmented and positioned in specific market where our cherished distributors and direct customers were losing out on sales. What kept our customers awake at night was the way the Chinese products were outselling them in their various markets based on the cheaper price options. Our business was suffering due to the influence of a cheap cement by the Chinese in our main markets. We were very happy when we were informed by the new cement which would be cheaper and better quality. Super Cool was a game changer for us. Super Cool is a super product. It has ensured our competitiveness in the market. Now we have captured back the market that we lost and our businesses are doing well. We are very happy it was introduced. Our net promoter score, which is the MPS, remains our key scientific methodology by which we're able to measure the satisfaction level of our customers in seeking continuous improvement wave after wave. And once we've been able to secure that solution for them, like in the case of Super Cool, we cement that partnership in profitability as we win in this journey more and more each year. Based on NPS score analysis and the feedback of the customers' constructive complaints, to meet the demand of the Eastern Georgian market, we made a decision to launch the pelletized system at Rustavi plant. And side by side, we started producing 40 kg packages instead of 50 kg. As a result, we aimed four important targets. The first, a high level of customer satisfaction with their success perfection. The second, customers' quantity increase. The third, the operative flexibility of the company and force NSP increase. The final strategic step in our palletized journey with improvement of customer satisfaction is to execute already mentioned project in Caspian in 2021. Sustainable market leader position, Heidelberg cement image, high quality and level of service make us the first mover on the market and simultaneously allow us fully switch to the palletized packaged cement nationwide. In Ital Cementi, we have started the MPS program in 2017. We have started the program by analyzing the customer journey in order to identify the touch points and the loyalty drivers. We have carried out this analysis by discussing with all the departments in the company to consider all the relevant topics in the customer experience. One of the identified touch points has been the product in back, which is a physical touch point that the customers may see and touch. The first scores in 2017 given by our customers to the quality of bags were quite bad. Therefore, we have made a deeper analysis to understand the reasons and we have identified one key point, the formation of lamps into the bags. At that period, we were using the plastic liner only during autumn and winter. We decided to extend the use of craft paper bags with plastic liner for all over the year and then the results clearly showed an increase from 7.35 in 2017 to 8.22 in 2020. This is a valuable result showing that we have been able to identify and solve an issue and at the same time we have given to our customers the evidence that we care their opinion. 